Hey everybody, I'm Manny. Welcome back to my channel, Soul Kettle Shave. So we're here back for another shaving video, and today will be my Thanksgiving shave. Um, in fact, because uh, I'll be busy tomorrow, you know, with the whole uh, helping to prep and set, in, set up and everything for the family to come over. Uh, this will be my shave before Thanksgiving, uh, so the day before. I just got back from over the road around um, like 9 o'clock in the morning, and it's uh, later on in the evening, uh, afternoon-ish. Um, as soon as I got home, showered, knocked out, woke up around 5.30 or so, and I'm uh, going to have a shave, so there's no face prep. Uh, hopefully, fingers crossed, we get along with the shave. So I hope you guys are doing well and safe out there and um, keeping your distance and doing the best that you can to get along with the whole COVID uh, Thanksgiving. This is the shave cream that we're gonna go in with today. This is my first time using this cream. I think I already, if I already popped the foil just to give it a whiff, if I'm not mistaken, um, but I have not used it. And uh, we'll see how we get on with it today. <clears throat> and it comes in a metal tube um there you have it in fact i'm actually glad that uh the video wasn't focusing uh so this is my second time doing the video um it wasn't focusing on the label when i went to go check it was on slow mo so that would have really sucked as if i would have made the whole video like that yeah so it does have the little uh nipple there to be able to pop the the foil the foil tab oh and i have it wait did i yeah, I did. So I have actually popped it, but I have not used it. And uh, with that, I will also be using the matching aftershave splash. This was a generous gift from a good friend of mine. And I'm gonna go ahead and lather it up in my scuttle today. And this is called the Dirty Bird Pottery from King George, Virginia. And there you have it. For anybody who's curious, it's got a lip inside here so when when the lather is, uh, is built it scoops back down into the bowl into the um, uh, scuttle i'm gonna fill it up with hot water it is wet because um i had let it sit under the faucet to start warming up Yeah, so I hope you guys are, are doing safe and keeping safe and do what you got to do to keep your significant other, your family safe as well. And uh, today's brush of choice will be my uh, Grizzly Bay. Uh, there you have it, a little retro brush bore with a 30, mil uh, 30, 30 millimeter bore knot from Whip Dog. And... Uh, Razor of choice would be my uh, marker progress. And I don't know what setting I'm gonna use. And uh, I'm gonna go in with these blades again. And I do have one sitting here on the side that's been used once. Hopefully we get along with it. And <clears throat> if not, we will switch it up. <sighs> Maybe I'll uh, lather up a little bit more on the face just to get some moisture in and um i don't know if i'm going to use any any uh post um, bombs or anything but um all right so let's get into it you know what I'm, excuse me i did something backwards and i can't show you guys up there i can't show you if there's no if there's water in it so I'm gonna squirt a lot of it in here. Damn, did I pop the cap? Hmm. What just got hard? Oh no, it's a thick ass cream. Wow, okay, it's a thick cream. Damn. Holy moly, that's really thick. It's very hard to push out of the tub there. <laughs> like it comes out like a, kind of like, um, what do you call, ah, uh, uh, shit, what's that called? Um, rat poison. Okay. So, 
Let me just even this out because it's gonna fucking kill me. <laughs> My OCD will drive me insane if I don't even this out. Um, and there you have it. So, all right. So, let's go ahead and load the razor here. Yeah, so, um, before I got home and got some rest, I was awake for about a little over 24 hours. Um, I was coming back from Lothian, Washington. My truck broke down and um, I had to stop and get a job done while I was on the road. So that sucked. There you have it. And uh, so I was away for a, a big portion of the time because uh, let's go with the, let's go setting five and see how we do on setting five. Because of COVID, they're not allowing anyone into the buildings where your truck is being worked on. So I had to sit down on a metal bench in the freezing fucking cold. So now I'm gonna fill it up with water. And uh, yeah, I sit up for the bit, most of the most uh, for most of the time, a big portion of the time, um, either standing up or sitting down. So that kind of really, you know, that really sucked. Um, you know, being over the road and tired, not having a place to, you know, sit and relax properly because it's so freaking cold outside. All right, so. I may have went in a little too wet. I didn't. My dumbass forgot to ring the push, um, fling the knot out. So I'm hoping we. <laughs> oh shit, this is really foamy. I put way too much water here. Let's see if we can. Yeah, so you can see how foamy it is. Let's see if we can uh, whip it up and aerate it good enough to make it a wet Jeffrey lather shave. Uh uh. Um, lather. So I'll just, um, yeah, you know what? Yeah, I will be able to save it. Just incorporating, um, some whipping action and, um, aerating it. Oh, yeah, yeah, this is gonna be fun. It's coming along nicely now. See some little air bubbles in there, but no big deal. Oh yeah, this is gonna be fun. All right. If not, we'll add a little bit more cream in there. Yeah, so, uh, got some work done on the road. Um, worked my ass off. Had a really good pay period. Um, so, can't complain. It's part of. It's come to the territory. This is a nice lavender. Oh yeah, by the way, it's a lavender scent. If you haven't already seen it already, sorry. Well, I can tell you, you can take a lot of water because I fucking drowned the shit out of this cream. If I didn't have any water in the scooter, I'd show you how much water was in there. Damn, and they could still take some more water. 
In fact, I think I will. It does good that it can take some more water because it gives me a little time to hydrate the whiskers. First pass with the grenade, see how we do. Not what I'd like it to be. I'm gonna go ahead and lower the adjustment. Um, doesn't feel as smooth. So we'll go to setting three. Let's see that. Setting the radio. But keep in mind, I have no face prep. I may have just nicked myself. Let's see. I put went in a little too too heavy there. My hand is cramping up. been working a lot of hours and uh, holding on to a steering wheel you know 24 7 and uh, um, uh, what do you call a uh, stick shift all day is uh, really a uh, Putting some uh, stress on my wrist. Been having a lot of back problems, and posture and shit like that. But uh, just lathering this cream was cramping up my hands. So we'll see how today's shave goes. <clears throat> This is some really good cream.
my sciatic was been out, you know. Doing a lot of pinched nerves. My back's pulling on my uh, sciatic nerve and therefore pulling on my nerves down my right and left leg. I'm standing at a weird angle. <sighs> Been drinking ibuprofen. <clears throat> Trim it on. To help with the pain. <clears throat> and I have um, I don't know three days four days ago probably more <clears throat> First time I saw the debut of this cream was on Spencer Frankel's channel. You guys remember him? <laughs> Good buddy of mine. Love you, buddy. Hope you're well. Doing safe. Being safe. And I uh, can't wait for you to return back to YouTube. <clears throat> All right. Against the grain. <clears throat> great performance, great slickness on the screen, man. Really, really happy with it.
And I love the scent too. The scent is light, <clears throat> but it's got its own um, unique um, <clears throat> lavender scent. Beautiful. All right, this is what we have in the brush and in the bowl. That's nice. All right, guys, I'm gonna do my clean passes off camera and I'll be back. <clears throat> All right, guys. Let's get on with the Allen stick. Got a little too close on the lid and right here. All my Kindle passions. All right, let me rinse off, guys. I'll be back. All right, guys. Feeling good. All right, <clears throat> let's get in with the aftershave splash. <sighs> and there is no restrictor on here, so you gotta put your finger over it. Time to finally sit back and relax. All right, this one definitely has uh, that um, signature um, natural lavender. It smells a little different off the bottle, but <clears throat> um, I thought it was gonna change. All right, so um, I wasn't gonna throw a bomb on, but why not? Let's let's put on a bomb, some ginger garden lavender. You may not have seen that in the picture, in the video or not, I'm not sure. I've already taken a picture, but um, I wasn't decisive of what to do. Guys, sorry, I'm fucking tired. All right, so what did we use today? We used the uh, Crema de Barba Arch Barrito Lavender. Um, awesome, awesome cream. Really happy with that. Nice performance. Um, went with the matching aftershave uh, splash. Lather it up in my um in my dirty bird scuttle pottery 
Um, really, really awesome. Um, uh, uh, scuttle. And uh, went in with my uh, Grizzly Bay with a 30 millimeter. Um, whipped up bore. Uh, razor of choice was the uh, Merker Progress. And we went in with the Derby used to blades. Um, smooth shave for first, second, and third pass. Um, uh, the cleanups uh, were a bit iffy, um, but great shave nonetheless. Smelling good, feeling good, and that is my shave, guys. That'll conclude the shave for the evening. Uh, hope you all enjoyed. If you do, please like, favorite, share, and subscribe out there. And uh, again, you guys. Be careful, stay safe, uh, six feet apart, <laughs> wear a mask, do what you got to do uh, to keep you and your loved ones safe. And hope you guys have a fantastic Thanksgiving. And so the next video, I'll see you guys then. Later, guys.